In this video, I'll introduce you to the scheduling component in NetAdvantage for WPF line of business. It's called the XAM schedule and it contains the features and the functionality you need to construct a fully Outlook-like uh, scheduling experience in your application. So let's take a look at some of the samples which come uh, together with the feature browser uh, in your downloadable package. The XAM schedule supports uh, all the different views you would see in Outlook, that being the day view, schedule view, and month view. So let's take a look at some of the samples in the day, in the day view. So what you see here is um, a, a view of how appointments can get added within, within a day's schedule. Appointments can be added uh, by a double click. Uh, this component does support both recurring appointments, reminders, as well as different time zones which cause your appointment to appear at different times on, um, on users running your software in different time zones. The XAMPP schedule also supports multiple day calendars. Uh, you, can, you can have uh, appointments which span more than one day and you can display uh, multiple days within the day view as well. The XAMPP schedule supports multiple calendars. Uh, you can have uh, in this tab view, you can have the appointments of two different resources, if you will, and you can, you can view them together on the same, on the same page. Recurrent appointments are also supported. Uh, you can add an appointment which is repeated uh, regularly throughout time. Um, these are some of the events which are being raised every time uh, the user interacts uh, with, the, uh, with this component. As you can see, uh, the active calendar changed event was, was fired every time we're, we're changing the active sheet here. Uh, we're, we're having um, the, uh, you can see the events being raised in uh, this list box above. Uh, you can see how uh, an event, uh, an activity was added, an activity was removed, the selected uh, time range changed. So uh, the XAM schedule implements a number of different events you can use to, uh, to do any pre or post processing after adding or removing an appointment after changing the active um, resource in this multiple day calendar and so on. Something else uh, that's very important to a lot of users is the ability to, uh, to control the appearance of, of any control. So, for example, in this view, uh, we're seeing uh, some of the ways in which you can customize uh, the appearance of the, of the XAM scheduler control. You can control the uh, display mode of, of dates, for example. You can switch those to uh, working. Uh, weekdays uh, or for all days in the week to be shown. As I mentioned earlier, the um, XAM schedule supports uh, time zones, so you can you can see how adding two different time zones here, uh, I can view the same appointment uh, at different times. So if you have users using your application on machines with different time zone settings, they're going to get uh, the correct uh, the correct time for for an appointment depending on the time zone that they're in. So let's take a look now at, at the schedule view. The schedule view uh, shows a horizontal view uh, of appointments uh, for a particular resource, and it also supports multiple day appointments, multiple calendars, which can be switched in a similar way to the one we saw earlier uh, with the day view. And again, the events um, that are being raised, those are um, identical to the ones provided uh, in the example we saw uh, just a minute ago. 
we can control the appearance here in the in the exact same way and it's it's basically just another view of the day view itself so if we're to take a look at the month view uh, you can see how closely the exam schedule resembles the standard outlook way of presenting a scheduler and you can use that to um, to deliver an appearance and also an experience which is very close uh, to um, it's actually identical to that provided by Outlook so as you can see we have recurrent appointments here illustrated across an entire month and uh, we have the same control over appearance here as well a few words about styling um, the exam scheduler supports a number of different themes office 2007 uh, blue black and silver and also office 2010 allowing you to to give your application um, an appearance which is identical with that in in the applications in the latest microsoft office 2010 uh, suite giving your applications a modern look and uh, presenting a familiar interface and appearance to your users. An important detail about these themes is the fact that uh, all of these colors and settings actually ship as standard with our product. So you don't need to install uh, any theme packs or anything else in order to take advantage of these um, appearance settings. Infragistics on the web at infragistics.com.